I should never have signed that Mandan pact with Ma Ling. Until after he gave me a chart of the secret route from China to India. He's dictating terms, Exceder. He won't tell a secret until the United States agrees to underwrite England and China. I know, I know, but that secret is vital to us. And we never will get it if this wild scheme of Martin's miscarries. Yes, but if Martin's plan succeeds, it means the elimination of the black samurai throughout Asia. It's worth the risk. Not in my opinion, it isn't. Deliberately allowing four black samurai members to travel on the Honolulu Clipper with Ma Ling and his party. By the way, two of those agents are women, aren't they? Mm-hmm. Well, suppose one of them should be this, this Fräulein von Teufel. What chance would Martin Fräulein have? Fräulein von Teufel's on the Clipper. She's walked into the trap Martin has set for her. Somehow I believed the other three when they said they didn't know anything. But you're lying. Now you people are spies, pirates. Piracy gets a death sentence in the United States. Now who's Fräulein von Teufel? Who is she? Who is she? Her name is... <laughs> Poison dart in his throat. Well, it begins to look like Fräulein von Teufel isn't any farther away than one of the women in this compartment. Nobody leaves this room until we find out who killed that Jap. We'll have to search everybody for a weapon that could have fired that dart. I'm sorry, Trudy. But that pencil could have been rigged to fire a dart. Oh, certainly, Tommy. Well, I am sorry, but it was the quickest way of clearing you of suspicion. Nobody really suspected you, Trudy. Thanks, Jack. You had me worried for a moment. Now, please don't break this one. I need it for my work. Party who are still alive. Yes, sir. Jack, wind's pretty bad. My command here. Help the mage and make my wife more comfortable. Both of you. talk to you. That is what I used to kill Samson with. If Martin finds it on any woman associated with the Black Samurai, he will think she is Fräulein von Teufel. No! 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 So, I shall 
should be proud to present you fools to Fräulein von Teufel. Whenever she chooses to reveal herself. Thanks, Wayne. Tell me, find out what happened to Trudy and Marling. I'm here, and Marling's all right. But that second German woman... Oh, Jack, I got there too late. I... Too late for what, Trudy? Use Naval Code 220. Say that I will send names of prisoners later. The detail is on deck, sir, ready to board the clapper. I have given them instructions concerning prisoners, as you ordered. Apparently, she used this scarf to muffle the sound of the shot. It's an odd thing for a suicide to do. At least we can find out who she was. Say, you know, Tommy said a pencil like this could be rigged to fire the poison dart that killed Sanson. Just like the one you had, Trudy. Was yours made in Germany? Well, I don't think so. I believe mine was made in America. I hope so. Because this may be the only means of identifying Fräulein von Teufel. We know she's a boy. May I see it? Sure. Don't point the... Oh, Jack, it was a weapon. Forget it. We didn't know for sure it was dangerous, but we do now. How'd you work it? I don't know. I think I pressed the eraser. Well, don't shoot any little poison darts at anybody now. That's an odd thing. May I have it to add to my collection? Sure. Nobody will be able to question Fräulein von Teufel now. Fräulein von Teufel? Yep. Of course, I should have known. But why would her own people shoot down her plane? Probably didn't need her anymore. The sub's alongside. Hey, drop gun. You are a wise man. You and this lady a member of Governor Marlene's party? Of course we are, but what does that Answer got to... Answer questions. Nothing more, please. Take Marlene's party aboard submarine. Leave all others on clipper. You may go, please. What's the idea of firing on a neutral American transport plane? Correction, please. America no longer a neutral nation. America does not know she is at war yet. Japan is on the way to Pearl Harbor now to declare war with guns and bombs. An undeclared war? I'd have never expected that. Even from Japs. Silence! Take them out. Follow them as prisoners. Bring me their personal belongings. In the morning, we shall discuss the Mandan secret. I'll get to a radio and warn Pearl Harbor what the Japs plan to do. That's a lot, George. You can do anything if you think about it long enough. Which one of you is ready to tell me the secret of the Mandan route to India? You couldn't pry it out of me even if I knew it. I suspect that as much. Your belongings suggest you are a press correspondent. Therefore, your interest would be less personal. I shall speak to you first. I don't know anything about... That remains to be seen. In addition to being press correspondent, I find from your belongings you are Fräulein von Teufel. That is correct. Knowing I was aboard the Clipper, why did you fire on it? So sorry. Must obey orders. Orders? From Tokyo. You also had orders from Berlin, through me. I take orders from Tokyo, not from Berlin. War makes a difference. Oh, yes, the war. Is Japan starting it with the sanction of their Führer? So sorry. Japan acts with or without the sanction of anyone, including the Fuhrer. We waste time. Has Marlene told the Mandan secret to any of your party? No. And he won't until he has signed a treaty with the United States in Honolulu. 
He will tell in one hour, or everybody will die. That's just like a Jeff. As long as Marling lives, there's still a chance to get the secret for our side. But if he is dead, there is no chance for China to get the secret. You will tell me the man on secret if you wish to live. I am not a young man. It will not be hard to die. It may be easy for you, but not for your friends. They will die too. You will consider it for one hour and then tell. Or I will send you all up to the surface one by one through the torpedo tubes. In accident, there is honorable custom. Ladies first. Is Wu-Tang do what he said? Certainly. And he'll start with us as he said he would. Wu-Tang, take me to him. I shall tell what he wants to know. But, Your Excellency, you mustn't betray your people. Would my people want me to betray my friends? No, sire. Then help me to the door. Wait a minute, Your Excellency. I, I've been tinkering with an idea that may work. He'll kill us anyway after you tell him, so we may as well take a chance to get to that radio. Now look, this may work. Wing, if this works, get on that radio and call Honolulu. Okay, give him the signal. Marling is prompt. One hour, exactly. Marling is ready to talk, but he's still too weak to walk alone. Let them pass. and make Marling as comfortable as possible. Janet, will you keep watching that periscope? We've got a lot to do. This radio needs some fixing before we can use it. Okay, when you and Tommy take over the controls, head for Honolulu full speed. Right. Let's hope no other Jap sub gets nosy. How we fix for fuel? We need to reach Honolulu. Jack, I've just picked up an American freighter. Well, that's what I've been hoping for. Break surface. Aye, aye, sir. I've got some signaling to do. Submarine on the port side, sir. Sub off our port bound. Something wrong with it. There's a white man on deck, signaling distress. Yes, sir.
Because our radio is gone, sir. He wants to come aboard. Caps. Plan. Attack. Honolulu. Please. Warn. So, he knows our plans, does he? Tell him to lay alongside our port side. Yes, sir. When the sub pulls into position, ram her. Aye, aye, sir. Lay alongside. They'll pick us up. How about Honolulu? They said they'd radio ahead and warn them. Yes, it won't be long now. Hard over. Hard over, sir. 